Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Spirit Breath Meditation. I invite you to take a deep breath through your nose. And pay attention to that air as it moves through your nostrils and exhales out, out of your nostrils. Just find a very comfortable position here for yourself. Just allowing yourself to sink into the very depths of your own being. Reminding yourself that you're here to have an inf intimate conversation with your soul, with your heart. So start that by just inviting yourself to recognize what you're feeling, what's going on in your life. Let things just bubble up to the surface of your mind and gently and lovingly, respectfully, just take a look at it all and just say, today I'm here to just allow all of this to just move aside and step into the wonder that is my mind. Hmm. So let's start with our three ohms. Here we go. <coughs> oh, oh. So as you, as you continue to breathe through your nostrils, just sit in this moment. Just sit for a brief moment and just allow yourself to entertain the wonder of this universe. So allow yourself to think for a moment about the way your body works all on its own. Some of us have had these bodies for a very long time. Some of us have had them a little bit less and some of us are still getting used to them. But they work in this wondrous, magnificent way. So our theme today is wonder. The wonder of life. The wonderlust of life. All the things that life has to offer to each and every one of us that is so spectacularly, breathtakingly, brilliantly beautiful. And it starts right here with the body. And so our affirmation this morning is, I stand in the wonder of life, accepting the body of my experience. I stand in the wonder of life, accepting the body of my experience. One last time, I stand in the wonder of life. So take a deep, deep, deep breath through your nose. And when you are ready, find a perfect place for you to lie down. If you're going to sit, just sit where you are. If you're sitting, you're hands are on your knees, your palms are up. If you're lying down, your arms are beside you with your palms up. I stand in the wonder of life, accepting the body of my experience. And so now we're going to go into five minutes of uninterrupted spirit breath. And that means you're going to breathe through your belly, into your chest, and exhale through your mouth. And you're going to do this at whatever tempo works for you. It's a spirit breath. You are oxygenating your body. You are breathing in through the belly, in through the chest, and out through the mouth. Five minutes. Allow the tempo to live you as you stand in the wonder of life. 
just experiencing, allowing and accepting the body of your, your experience. Here we go.
Now I invite you to continue your spirit breath, continue breathing in through the mouth, into the chest, and out through the mouth, in through the belly, into the chest, and out through the mouth. And I invite you to find your perfect rhythm. It can be a continuous breath. Pulsing breath. It can be any rhythm your body designates for you. The body is that perfect intuitive knower that knows exactly what it needs to do, what it needs to be, how it needs to act in any given situation. <clears throat> I stand in the wonder and accept all, all that my body will take right here, right now. I stand in this perfect wonder of life. What is the wonder of life? It's allowing all that life brings forth. It's allowing all that I experience in life to experientially know me, to move through me. Continue breathing. I stand in the wonder of life and allow all that my body experiences, all of the experiences of life, the air as it moves through my body, my lungs as they expand, the joy in my face as I feel the oxygenation, feel the tingling of the fingers of the toes, recognize the aliveness of life that pours through each one of us here as we celebrate this breath. the life force that moves in and out through my body, bringing life and energy to every cell, every organ, to my eyes, to my ears, to my nose, my mouth, to my arms, my legs, everything that has supported me all of these years. In time, the wonder of life is infinite. The wonder of a child as it moves into its first breath, the wonder of a baby as it looks at the world it has been brought into with such curiosity, with such abandon, with such spontaneity, continuing this spirit breath in through the belly, into the chest, and exhaling through the mouth, feeling that vibrancy as it moves through the body. celebrating the wonder of life. Can you remember what it felt like to see the ocean for the first time? First time you were brought in front of that vast ocean. The Atlantic, the Pacific, the Caribbean. All these major beautiful bodies of water that our eyes see for the first time, and yet when we see them, the wonder of life brings us that experiential knowing, that remembrance. Ah, I remember the ocean. I am the ocean. That's the wonder of life, that everything we see, touch, taste, hear, feel, it reminds us who we are. So in this moment, as I breathe first into the belly, into the chest, and out through the mouth, I am reminded who I am. I 
become the wonder of life. I am the entire ocean in a drop. I am the 300-year-old oak tree that sits right outside my door. I am the flower in the vase next to me, knowing that I am breathing the same air. I am the animals that surround me. I am the curiosity in the baby's eyes. I am the knowledge in the scientist's brain. I am the joy in the 92-year-old that is surrounded by love and celebrated on her birthday. I am the happiness I experience when I see the grade on a test. I am the fulfillment of the life I am living as I see everything that shows up as the wonder in my life, as I accept all of this experience so that my body feels, hears, thinks, knows. Continue breathing, first through the belly, into the chest, exhaling through the mouth. And in this moment, just pausing at the top of the breath, just pause for a moment to let whatever wonder wants to be that extra little spark of wonder in your life to show up. And just breathe through the belly, into the chest, Momentary breath, and I exhale. And which, with each breath, I allow that much more wonder into my life. I allow that much more joy into my life with each pause. I allow that much more happiness into my life. And in that pause, if you feel like smiling, just smile. Feeling all the love that is present right here in this moment. It is so important to pause every now and then to remember that who I am is unlimited. To pause in that moment and allow the wonder of life to feel itself through me. Pausing just to remember that life is here to be lived, as Thomas Troward says, to enjoy, to be in the joy of life at all times as the beautiful Tom Costa says, no, no matter what. At any age, in any place, at any time, in any body, I am the fulfillment of the divine, knowing myself as pure wonder. Now you can let go of the pause and just go back to your three-step breathing. Remind yourself of our affirmation. I stand in wonder and accept all the experiences of my body. So now let's just put a little focus on our body today. So I invite you to take your arms and just raise them into the sky, directing those arms up and just letting the fingertips just wiggle a little bit, 
feeling that beautiful energy that is the body. Continuing to breathe and feel that wonder, feel that energized wonder, that energized, creative, functioning life force and use your arms to just play around and feel it. Scoop it up into the air, move it around, throw it like a child throwing a snowball in the most amazing winter storm. School is off and there's nothing to do but play in the snow. And so just take those hands and just move that energy everywhere. Just take it, scoop it, throw it. Have the most wonderful, wonderful, joyful experience. Moving the body, moving the arms, feeling that you are the energy of life moving through this thing called wonder. And then take scoops of that energy, that healing divine energy, and just move it wherever your body requires it. Wherever your body is saying, yeah, over here, I want more. I could use some more energy right here in this hip. I could use some more energy right here in these knees. I could use some more energy right here in this head, in this ear, in this throat, wherever. The body is a wonderful, beautiful tool to give us the opportunity to experience the body of life. And so move that body, move those arms, bring that energy up and bring it back down, bring it across, throw it forward, bring it behind you. It is all the very essence of who and what you are. Continue your breathing. And when you are ready, just allow those arms to slow down to a beautiful Agnes DeMille movement, just allowing them to poetically dance through your room, through the energy, until you finally bring them to this most beautiful hug. Just bring it in and embrace yourself. Because in all reality, you are the wonder. You are the wonder of the universe. And in this time of being on our own a lot of the time, I'm gonna invite you right now in this hug to just imagine all of the dearest and closest people to you hugging you. Just feel their hugs, all those loved ones right here. But there is only one time and one space. So right here in the midst of this, allow the most wonderful, loving people in your life. They can be here, they can be gone. But right in this moment, in this wonderful moment, let's remember that there is only one love and it is mine to have, mine to hold, mine to embrace. And I can feel the love of the universe just sweeping through each and every one of us. And when you are ready, I invite you to go ahead and just bring your arms back to your knees if you are seated. Bring your spirit breath to a comfortable rhythm. If you're lying on the floor, just bring your arms down to your side. Just find the perfect rhythm for you. And in this breathing, in this understanding, our spiritual truth, our philosophy teaches us that at any point, the fullness, the allness of God is experienced. Right where I am, the fullness of the universe, every person I have ever loved, every person I have ever been in relationship with, all of it, past, present, and future, all right here in this perfect, beautiful, wonderful moment. So that embrace that you just released stays imprinted on your heart for all time and eternity. 
There is no separation. There is just oneness. So just bring your breathing to its perfect place. Just allow this wonderful moment to have its perfect play in your body, in your mind, in your heart, realizing that everything is connected. I stand in the wonder and accept all that my body experiences. Everything, soup to nuts. Just continue breathing through your mouth, in through the tummy, in through the chest, out through the mouth. We're gonna do something just a little different today at the end of our spirit breath. Let's take those 10 pulsating breaths at whatever rhythm's good for you, but I will give you my rhythm. Here we go. Just allow it to find its perfect rhythm right here. Now, without missing too much, too many beats, at the rhythm that you choose, breathe into your tummy, your chest, take a little extra exhale, and a little extra inhale, and then exhale. Here we go. Here we go. And, ah, and really let it out with an audible sound. Ah. ah, continue doing that for a few more breaths. If you're a singer, this is the time for your aria. Relax into the perfect spirit breath, breathing through the mouth still. Feel that wonder, that joy, that energy that permeates the air that blows through your entire being. You are not only the breath, you are the breather. And you are not just the breath and the breather, you are that which breathes the breather, all of it, back into infinity, forward into infinity, side by side with infinity as the infinity itself. So when you're ready, just take your spirit breath and let it meld perfectly into breathing through the nostrils. And I invite you to move from a spirit breath into half and half and then into breathing through the nostrils. See what that feels like to allow the breath to just morph naturally. Slowly <laughs> moving it over to the nostrils. Hmm. Bring your attention back to the room, back to your body wiggling your fingers and your nose. Yes, sometimes bringing your knees up to your chest, rolling around a little bit, finding your perfect, perfect, harmonious place in the center of this infinite thing called life. And when you're ready, if you're lying down, just bring your knees over to the side and just lay be there for a moment, allowing yourself to be cradled in the embrace of this beautiful energy called love, life. And just maybe lie there for a second if you want. Take your arms to your side, pushing yourself back up. And come back to a seated position as we all join together in this seated position. And I leave you with this idea. 
There is a wonder inherent in everything. Every situation, every experience. The body is a wondrous thing. Regardless of what it may be experiencing or doing, there is wonder at the center of it. So today I invite you to take that wonder, take that curiosity, take your ability to think and know and experience and position it so that the wonder of life shows itself to you, through you, as you. Each moment as this day unfolds perfectly and beautifully. So let's take this beautiful spiritual practice and resonate it in the body with three ohms. Here we go. There's a wondrous place in you and a wondrous place in me that when we are in that space of wonder, we share that one space. Thank you for, sparing, for sharing your spiritual practice here with me this morning. I am so, so, so grateful. Namaste. And of course, welcome home. <laughs>